and welcome to a very special celebrity catchphrase. Three comedy couples will be playing the game, so <laughs> let's see who's playing catchphrase tonight. Our first comedy pair are famous for both the League of Gentlemen and Inside Number Nine, which has to make you think what is going on inside their heads. It's <laughs> Reese Shearsmith and Steve Pemberton. <laughs> Gentlemen, good to see you. How are you feeling? Nervous. Very nervous. Strangely nervous. Well, the thing is, you've been on the show before. Yes. So, surely that eases the nerves, doesn't it? It does, but then I've got this guy with me who's kind of bringing me down, yeah. making me sort of <laughs> bit jittery. <laughs> so, Saying it, that. <laughs> are you nervous? It must be nicer that you're working together. It is, yeah, yeah, no, it's good, but um, I've never played a game before. <laughs> so I'm quite excited about actually just enjoying a, a game. You've never played a game? Not really. In your life? Of course you are. I've never met anybody who's <laughs> never played a game. Yeah. That's Steve. We know you from Benny Dorm. Yeah. What was that like? Because how many years did you do it? Nearly seven years I did that. Wow. It wasn't really a job. You couldn't call it a job, just turning up. There's your sunbed, there's your trunks, there, yeah. you know. <laughs> there's the swimming pool. It was fantastic. And the karaoke in the evening, so I loved the whole package. Uh, Reese, how true is this that you're a fan of magic? Oh, yes, very true, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, ever since I was a little boy, yeah, I've just had uh, an obsession with it, yeah. Who, uh, who Reese is, um, your favourite magician? <laughs> um... <laughs> hey! <laughs> <laughs> you do magic? Do, are you joking? <laughs> In your line of work, you do have to learn lines. You're both writers as well. Do you think that's going to help with the catchphrases tonight? We hope so. I mean, I'm unsure of what constitutes a catchphrase. So, because I know sometimes it's just a word, isn't it? Or it can a, be, yeah. A pronoun. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I'm going to be uh, looking out for those as well as the actual obvious catchphrases. Every correct answer is worth £100 for your charities and the bonus is worth £500. Just say what you see. What has he just done? Reese? No, it was him. <laughs> Steve? <laughs> Tennis racket. <laughs> oh. Say what you see. <laughs> that, yes, that is definitely a tennis racket. <laughs> but let's try now put it into a phrase. Right. And that will be beautiful. Ah, okay. oh, I think I've he's got, got it now. now. <laughs> right. You know the name of the show, don't you, Steve? <laughs> OK. Let's carry on playing. <laughs> Go on. Steve and Reese. Making a racket. Making oh. a racket. <laughs> Well done. That's £100 in your bank. You are off the mark. Oh. He's gone for it. Let's reveal it. Easy. <laughs> prison break. No, it's not prison break, <laughs> but always worth a try. Linda. Caught on camera? It is caught on camera. Yeah! <laughs> I've got one. Caught on camera. Right. Right. You're brilliant. You're brilliant. Right, back to the bonus. Steve. Comedy goal. It is comedy goal. Comedy goal. <laughs> As are you. <laughs> Take it away. Oh, what's he doing? See what you see. Oh, just out of time, OK? Sorry. Sorry. Who's it holding? <laughs> Nina. Peter Piper. Picked a peck of pickled peppers, a peck of pickled peppers, peeps a piper picked. Yes. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, where's the peck of pickled peppers? Peter Piper picked. <laughs> <laughs> what has Mr. Chips just done there? Steve. Uh, meet and greet? No, it's not meet and greet, but you're not frozen out. Let's carry on. Reese. Is it put a name to the face? Correct! Yeah. Beautiful work. Is this one going to help you? Is it pet detective? Oh, no, but that's not a bad guess. It is, it is, it is a pet detective. Well, he is a pet is. detective. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's just not the catchphrase we're looking oh, for. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. no. Is that one of the rules? That's one of the rules. Now, and how is he doing it? He's not doing it. Steve, speed dial. Here's speed oh. dialing. I was going to press the button. I was just a... Let's take it away. Oh, we want that bottom right one, don't we? Um, 
dogs? So, raining cats and dogs? <laughs> oh, no, but always worth a try. This is good. The driver's smell. I think smell. Steve thinks he knows it. Ah, oh, I think right. so. Right. Oh. Reese, uh, beach combing. Beach coma. <laughs> we'll take that. Beach coma, beach combing. Yes. Yeah. Well done, Reese. Yeah. Let's take it away. And the answer to the bonus is who let the dogs out? He's got it right. Yeah. Yeah. So hoping to raise a little bit more than a laugh. Now, Reese, you said at the start of the show that this is the very first game you've ever played. Yeah. How are you finding it? I'm really enjoying it. I should have done it, started this kind of thing earlier. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Well, you are in the lead at the moment, Steve. The last time you were on Catchphrase, you actually did make it to the Super Catchphrase, didn't you? I did. I got yeah. to the pyramid and, uh, and did all right, so... Yeah. How confident are you tonight? Um, I don't know, 50-50. We've got some very good competition here who mm. are very fast on the buzzer, so yeah. we'll see how we get on. Yeah. Linda, how are you finding it being on Catchphrase for the first time? Well, it's more fun than I thought it would be. <laughs> <laughs> Every catchphrase wins you £200 and there's a whopping £1,000 for the bonus. Buzz in when you like, but give me a wrong answer and this time you will be frozen out. Mm. Good luck to you all. Let's play Catchphrase. Get ready. There's your clue. Reese. Doctor Who. It is Doctor yeah. Who. Uh. Extra £200 in your bank. Elvis impersonator? <laughs> no. Uh huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh. Steve. Pulling rank. He is pulling rank. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. No, it's not. OK, so she's having a bit of a tantrum. She's a bit over the top. <laughs> Steve. She's a drama queen. She certainly is. I was thinking Princess. <laughs> chat up lines? It's not chat up lines, Ooh. but you're along the right lines. What's Mr Chips just done there? Steve. Drawing a blank? He's drawing a blank. Drawing a blank. Oh, <laughs> Shut up lines. Blowing a kiss. No. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Only one more square to go. Just say what you see. <laughs> what is it? I think it's a ginger nut. It certainly <laughs> is. <laughs> Flirting with, with danger. danger. That is correct! <laughs> Stephen Reese, way ahead at the minute with £3,000. <laughs> Nina. Turn that frown upside down. That is absolutely wow. correct. Yeah. Well so you're frozen out. As soon as this catchphrase starts to play, your buzzers will be in action. Look at Nina. Look. <laughs> She's an eager beaver. She thinks she knows the bonus as well. Is she going to get there? Or will she be blocked out by Stephen Reese? <laughs> oh! oh, oh, oh. No. Right, Stephen Reese. <laughs> the butt of the joke. Oh. That is correct. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Is it going to help you? Do you think you know? Tom, Dick, and Harry. Did uh -oh. not say that is it not? We all said it. Yes, it is! Oh. <laughs> Stephen Reese in the lead at the moment with £4,800. <laughs> Nina. Yes. Wind up the merchant. Help me out, Linda. Uh, oh, come on. You, <laughs> mind, you were so close. Oh, no. You virtually said it. Right, Danny and Robert think they know. Stephen Reese think they know. Now Nina, <laughs> Nina's clocked it. Right, who's going to get in first? As soon as it starts to animate, all your buzzers will be in play. Come on! Come on! Yes! Yes! Nina! Wind up it is a wind-up motion. 
You can't be frozen out. Steve. Reece. More tea, Vicar. More tea, Vicar. Yes, it is. <laughs> Reese, um, chicken drumsticks. Correct. Oh, oh, my God. Well done. <laughs> did you know that one as well, Danny? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. I did. I said it. I yeah, said it. You just buzz in. <laughs> oh, yeah, I can't just... beat him. He's speedy Gonzalez. He's got bionic fingers. Uh, that was a big oh, clue. Stephen Reese. A tall order. Oh, it's a tall order. It is a tall order. Oh. Reese and Steve. Are on six thousand three hundred pounds. Oh. <laughs> Steve, um, make your bed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we just need it as a catchphrase. Where is it? <laughs> Stephen Reese, a mole in the camp. There's a mole in the camp. Oh, oh I don't even know that. Yeah. Right. Reese and Steve, you are tonight's winners and will be facing the Super Cat Train. Yes! After the break, it'll be like one of my jokes. No laughing matter, as Reese and Steve go for the big £50,000 for their charities. Can they do it? Um, how are you feeling now, Reese? Very nervous now. I didn't expect to get this far, so it's... Yeah. It's weird, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And you've been in this position before. Yeah. Does it make it any easier? No, it doesn't. It's very nerve-wracking and I, 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 miss, I miss the podium. Yeah, bit of security. <laughs> yeah. One. We're off. So, driving in my car. Driving... Spaghetti, Spaghetti Junction. Junction. Correct. Nine. Nine. Ice cream van. Cornet. A uh, group of cornets. Oh, oh, um, uh, uh, what's... roundabout cone. E is a cornet. Oh, God, what is it? Uh, pass. Eight. Coming up, roses. Water. Water uh, mouth. Mouth. Oh, what's that? Water in mouth. Water in the lips. Uh, pool. Mouth pool. Uh, pass? Pass seven. Bellboy. Bell Correct. Eleven. Book liquor. <laughs> book. Book, bookworm. Book fighter. Uh, what's oh. Name? Eat it. Book eater. <laughs> you got five thousand pounds. I know. Don't don't oh. be disappointed. No, it is hard. Oh. And I tell you what. A couple of tricky ones there, you know. They were hard. What they was the cornet? OK, let's go through them, because yeah. I know you like to know the answers at yes. home as well. Number eight. Mouth-watering. Oh, oh, of course! Of course it is. Let's go to number nine. It's a traffic cone. Oh. We said everything but... I know, I know. It's so easy when you get the answers. So yeah. Number 11. Doing so, it was just at the very last minute you ran out of time. He swallowed a dictionary. Watch, oh. there it is. Oh. But listen, Stephen Reese, you are Never taking mind. away the six thousand eight hundred pounds you had in your bank from earlier on. Now, that extra five thousand pounds, which takes your total prize money for your charities to eleven thousand eight hundred pounds. <laughs> Come on in, guys. One more name check for your charities, please. That's Dasa, that's the schools in Dominica. Greenpeace. Uh -huh. Macmillan Nurses. Incredible. Derry and House. It's uh, Neuroblastoma Research. JDRF, Type 1 Diabetes Cure. Beautiful. Listen, you've all been fantastic. Thank you so much for being on the show. And thanks to you for watching. And we'll see you very soon for more Catch Rays. Good night. <laughs>